Okay. Josh is obviously like. <laughs> <laughs> I'm okay. drop shit. We started. I'm drop shit. Okay. I, I stopped. <laughs> foods from other countries so she's going to tell you about this one. Um, this week we are testing food for Israel. So this is the what the box looks like. This is what the side looks like and then inside there's all these different snacks that we're going to try out. The first one <laughs> we're going to start off with it's these like crumbly nougat bites and I should no, in there no. like <gasps> Okay, the first snack we're trying is these. They're called the Kremly Nougat Bites, and they're peanut butter covered cereal bites with hazelnut cream. That sounds good. So good. Mm -hmm. I got you. Don't worry. Oh, they're like. Whoa. Ooh. There's like a box. Man, you got me excited. This is like crazy. So I'm gluten free, so I can't eat these, but this is what they look like. They look good. Do y'all have any crypto? No, I'm just gonna buy some today. Oh my god. It's good. So this one we're gonna try is the Bisley onion flavored wheat snack. What? Yay, more pineapple for me. It's a flavored wheat snack. It's onion flavored. It looks like a kind of like a Frito, not but circular, like circles. You know what that looks like? Uh, cornucopias. Do you remember those? Oh, you used to put them on your nails yeah. like when you were a kid. Yeah. Those are so fun. Damn, that's pretty good. You go. I need those. Cornucopia. <laughs> I knew what you were talking about. These are pretty good. good. Yeah, those are pretty good. They're different like flavor a, than what we have. It tastes like a fun but crunchier. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. That's pretty good. These are good. Bro. I don't care about any of this. Okay. Cleanse your palate. Okay. Okay, so next we're um, gonna try these. They kind of look like corn nuts, but um, they're falafel shashi and they're falafel flavored puffs. Falafel flavored puffs. Oh, what is a falafel flavor? It's like cheese balls, like, baby cheese balls. Or, or cereal, like, like no, a little they cereal. Look like corn they feel like corn nuts. No, it feels like a puff of air, like a Cheeto puff. I don't know if I like this. Whoa, is there glue in it? I'm gonna need a couple more. Oh my god, it looks exactly like Ritz. Do you remember that candy called Ritz? No. Remember, like, little kind of contains wheat. Contains gluten, says it right there. Yeah. Mm. I like that. But it's it reminds me of Ritz, like even the packaging. It does remind me. The first taste was like a sweaty arm. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's too small. Alright, so the next thing we're trying is this. It's called a Chick Chack, and it's everything flavored. And it says it's wheat spirals with spices. What is everything flavored? Like another snack. So that that joy. Joy. Almost though. Almost. This is not good for gluten free people. It tastes exactly like. Girl. What is that face that you're making? It tastes right like now. how a car wires smell when they're burning. Oh, yeah. Or like gas. It looks like a noodle. <laughs> it looks like a dried noodle. Oh, I want to. <laughs> this smells like that. Um... It's like they tried to smoke like things. No, 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 no. Oh, yeah. There's literally a food that like people love that's like this. Okay, um, this part is my favorite part. I love it when we get to the candies and the chocolates and stuff because they're always the best. Like, and they're I just so good. Them. And it looks yeah, like you eat, eat them. them. Yeah, they're so good. So this one is we have a whole chocolate bar and it says it's a Strauss popping chocolate with milk, milk chocolate with popping candies. So I'm thinking like a crunch bar, but we'll find out. It has popping candies in it. <gasps> Whoa. How many times did they wrap this? I was just trying to be careful. Chocolate. Oh, it smells. Can you smell? Mm. Okay. 
Oh, that's so good. Oh, I want to. You know, right now, I feel like I'm like opening up a chocolate bar for Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. I was just going to say that. I was just going to say that. Little cows. Oh my god, there's cows yeah, on it. it. So oh, it looks so good. Mm. Oh my god. Mm. This is like literally like It crunch. is Pop Rocks. It is Pop Rocks. It's Pop Rocks. Stop moving your mouth. I know. It's Pop Rocks. Oh my god. <laughs> Oh my god. We oh my god. Oh. 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 It's gone for me. It's so good. It's still going for me. It's in my throat now. Um. My oh. mouth is still popping from that chocolate. Okay. The next one we're gonna try is this little candy, and it's like coated in powdered sugar. It looks like um. Well, it it's like a pomegranate Turkish delight. And it says that it's pomegranate candy with almonds in it. What is it? Oh no. Is it flour? Is it flour? No. What is it? Cornstarch. Oh my yeah. god, it's cornstarch. Yeah. It literally tastes so like flour, good. but it's so interesting. Very into my from touching it, it's so soft now. <laughs> okay, um, now we're gonna try this little thing. Um, it is a marone coconut roll, and it's a coconut bar rolled in coconut flakes. This sounds so good. Um, now we're gonna try this. Yes. It's like eating pure coconut. Mm. I'm down for that. Like like a piece of crown. Oh, it does. Yeah. It's good. FD and Red Sport? FD and Sea What is that? I love coconut. It's pretty good. That is so good. It is pretty good. Okay. This is our last one. So now we're going to try this little candy. And it's a mini pistachio halva. And it's sesame candy with pistachios. Okay. It doesn't look like chocolate. It's really like strange, but it's super good. The first bite is very good. And we also have like another one, so. Oh, nice. I like this. It's all yours, too. I don't. Mm. Oh, oh my god, I like this. I'm so not much. a fan of that. No. This is so good. It's time. Which of these businesses tried and then failed to spread to Israel? A. Burger King. B. McDonald's. C. Starbucks. D. Pizza Hut. I'm gonna say Starbucks. I'm saying Burger King. It's definitely Starbucks. Starbucks. I was gonna say it's definitely not McDonald's. <laughs> Number two. Who was once asked to be the president of Israel? A. Dwight D. Eisenhower. B. Albert Einstein. C. Elvis Presley. D. Martin Luther King Jr. Elvis Presley. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Einstein. What was, was B again? Einstein. What was the first one? Uh, Dwight D. I, I was at Eisenhower. I'm gonna go B because you didn't even pronounce it right. I'm saying Elvis. I'm saying B. It was Einstein. Why did you know that? Because so he, fast. he's from, um, he's Israel. He's from Is Israel. He's born there. Yeah. Whoa! She said, it, she said it so fast that I was like, Einstein, he's from there. <laughs> Hawaii. 
And I didn't realize how small it's it was. Can you like repeat the first two? I'm gonna what was me? Um, A was Montana, B was Rhode Island. I'm saying Rhode Island. I'm gonna say New Jersey. Okay. It was New Jersey. Damn. Ooh. It's 8,522 square miles. Wow, that's that's really good. Okay. Okay. Um, number five. Hebrew is the only language that A has been successfully revived from the dead. B features an alphabet with over 50 characters. C doesn't use punctuation. D is written in all capitals. Ooh, that's the same one. B. Punctuation. I also want to say B, but C sounds so reasonable. So they like, all they, except for the no all capital. Oh, yeah. I don't know either. Oh, I think it's B or C. Mm -hmm. Josh, would you? Mm -hmm. No punctuation. This is so exciting. I didn't know this. It has been successfully revived oh from the dead. Oh, my God. It's the only oh. one. It's the oh. only one. Damn. Yeah. I can't believe it's the only one. That's like, so sad. It, there's like a paragraph and it's it says languages can die in Hebrew did for 1,700 years. That is so, so sad yeah. because we lost so much history. Yeah. Like so everything that other like languages had ever written. They, like we like lost so much yeah. information. After Israel yeah, became like independent um, in 1948, Hebrew was listed alongside Arabic as an official language. And, it, and in 2018, it took the sole spot. Wow. Number six. In the city of Jaffa, you can buy this unique ice cream flavor. A. Ketchup. B. Hummus. C. Mustard. D. Falafel. Ketchup. Hummus. Falafel. It is hummus. Damn. <laughs> That's so cool. Number seven. Um, number seven. Which of the following is true about Israel's government? A. It is the only country to ever have two co-presidents. B. The legal voting age is 13. <laughs> C. <laughs> so citizens, citizens from other countries can run for political office. D, there are over 200 different political parties. I'm seeing the 13 year old. I'm gonna say. What was the first one? Um, is the only country to ever have two co presidents. Ooh. I'm gonna say the co president one. Yeah, me too. This is shocking. No, oh it's God. 200 parties, isn't it? Yes. Yep. 200 parties. That's pretty cool. That's so cool. It's a okay. lot. Number eight, we can thank Israel for which of the following inventions? A, wireless headphones, B, CD player, C, laptop computer, D, USB flash flash drive. say USB. Yeah, C. I thought, uh, yeah, I think it's USB. Yeah, yeah. Last one, number nine, why is the Dead Sea named as such? A, Moses died in it 3,000 years ago. B, no plants or animals can survive in it. C, frequent lightning storms overhead make it extremely dangerous. D, it's a misnomer to convince people not to travel there. B, like a storm. It's a misnomer. No plants can live there. What'd you say? Lightning storm. It's no plants or animals can survive there. I actually knew that one. That is extremely yeah. salty. So yeah, it's so, it, like, it's so salty. Alright, so hope, I hope you guys liked watching this. Um, these aren't actually that expensive, so you can like go on their website and see how much they cost. It was like $12 for this one. And they have like big ones too, like this is the smallest one. Yeah, and you get like 10 to 12 snacks usually. But yeah, thanks for watching. Bye! Bye. From the top. Hey guys, so my friend Hannah gets these food boxes every month and Oh my god, that was awesome. <laughs> I can't stop laughing. I didn't do it. What was I planning? What did I tell you I was going to say? You were going to like say that I get the box. No, I'm going to laugh at you. Why? What was I even going to say? <laughs>